Well, tonight, New Hampshire has its first confirmed case of the Zika virus. The disease that mosquitoes are spreading quickly is going through Latin America. And health, health officials tell us the New Hampshire patient contracted the virus through sexual contact. This is a new one for New Hampshire. We were announcing today the first case of a Zika infection identified in a New Hampshire resident. New Hampshire state epidemiologist Dr. Benjamin Chan says the patient is a woman who contracted Zika through sex with her male partner who traveled to a country where mosquitoes are spreading the virus. Zika virus is mainly transmitted through the bite of an infected mosquito. Uh, and specifically, there's a specific type of mosquito, the Aedes mosquitoes, which we do not have in New Hampshire. So individuals are primarily going to um, contract this by travel to affected areas. Those areas include South America, Central America, and the Caribbean. The big concern is that Zika may be linked to microcephaly, which causes severe birth defects. Because of this, Dr. Chan says there are specific recommendations for pregnant women and those who could become pregnant. Anybody that travels should take strict precautions against preventing mosquito bites. That includes using an EPA registered insect repellent, wearing long sleeves and pants, you know, staying indoors where there's screens and, uh, and uh, mosquito nets possibly. And he says any woman who is pregnant should consider postponing her trip to these areas because of the risk to the fetus. Additionally, if a pregnant woman has a male partner that traveled, the recommendation from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention is to uh, either abstain from sex or to use a condom correctly and consistently every time uh, a sexual encounter occurs to try and prevent the mother from getting infected with the virus. Now doctors say the New Hampshire woman who contracted Zika has already completely recovered and poses no health threat to others.